Good recognition by the Hornets because Zach picked up an early foul. Landry 17 points. Phoenix was the opposition on Friday night for the Hornets in New Orleans and uh, Hornets took care of them. Gasol tried an up and under and then reverse pivot and a hook. Marcus Gasol from, Mark from the floor. Ameka Okafor settles into a jumper. Bank won't open. See Sam Young posting up a lot now. He has the size advantage over Bellinelli. See how the Grizzlies will continue to go to that matchup. Gasol screens, pick and roll, and a touch pass intended for Tony Allen is picked off by Trevor Ariza, who is ninth in the league in steals. Bellinelli tries to go deep. Offensive rebound, Carl Landry. Good position, foul on Conley. Three-point opportunity, and Carl Landry wearing out the Grizzlies early. He's got eight and a chance to get to nine. And if you think about it, the thing that hurt the Grizzlies last week in the, the situations when they presented themselves, not forcing his offense, not trying to be more than who he is, and has worked in his favor. He did have one year in Boston where he averaged a little more than 11 a game. Gasol tries to back down, nine to shoot. Sam Young, contact, Mark wide open, sends it and scores it. Mark Gasol over the last three is averaging 14 and nine boards with two or more assists. That's the second longest streak of his career. And that's his second assist tonight. So the streak lives on. Gasol with a block. His block streak lives on, but then Sam saves and a reset of the shot clock. Deflected by Randolph and that pass too hot. Intended for Mecca Okafor. Ooh, that was a Randy Johnson fastball pass inside. It couldn't be caught. But here, this is the Zach Randolph new. This isn't the old Zach Randolph. I mean, obviously he's returning to the postseason after a four-season absence. And ironically, in light of the way this game has transpired so far, Brevin, one of the big differences, the Grizzlies, the second most improved team in hanging on to the basketball, but they've turned it over six times. Foul on Bellinelli is the Grizzlies trying to make Marco play a little defense because he's played a lot of offense so far. Yeah, and Fish, Rob Fisher, the next one goes down also. Well, Mayo and Battier come in, and in two possessions, they both score. Shane Say just need to get the beard off, he can score. Marcus Shaw with a knockaway. Raked it away from Okafor. Four turnovers on the Hornets. Grizzlies look for the lead under a minute and a half. Gasol turns, fires, and fills it up, and the Grizzlies have the lead back at 28 to 27. Well, no up and under, no mess around. Don't fake. He's. Uh, it's like that was a foul. Yeah, Brown and Ellie got away with a little bit of a bump. And Mike Conley, I think, is on a campaign. Like, can I get a call? Because he takes a lot of contact. Landry underneath, lost it. And they're going to say it's last touch by the Grizzlies. Take a look at this drive against Marco Bellinelli. And anybody Bellinelli is guarding, they're just licking their chops, getting to the basket. Got away with the bump there, but nice concentration and finish by Mike. Tony Allen on Bellinelli, three and a half remaining first half. But Mike spent a lot of time on the floor in that Sacramento Kings game. Chris Paul finds Okafor, and a foul taken by Sam Young. And what, what makes him so good is they set the pick and roll so high, forcing the guard to come out. Then now he has a running start at the big. There are not too many bigs. He is scoring along with assisting. You're not going to win. If he is assisting, that means you have one part of his game. He is not He is not doing well. We just have to continue to live with this right now. Zebo on the cut got bumped by Okafor. Late in the game, I want to see if Bellinelli's make the big jump that the guard is trailing. A dump down pass to the big guy, Matthew with a two-hand slam. Hornets led by eight in the first quarter. Ooh, collision. Mecca Okafor, Mark Gasol, Sam Young, that pass in tight quarters. As we take a look at Mecca Okafor out of UConn. Yeah, this is, he wasn't grabbing his head off the knock by Mark Gasol tonight. Bellinelli knocked away. Tony Allen on the defense. Sam Young. And Ariza knocks it away. Yeah, it's unintentional by Ariza. I think that ball was dribbled off his foot by mistake. And Randolph reels in the three-point miss by Bellinelli. So no harm. Deep catch. Gasol. Too big. And, and I like that he is using his size, using his strength against Landry in the first half. Shot over the top of him a couple times. And that time just ran down the middle of the court. Seals him underneath the basket and a great entry pass. Grizzlies their largest lead of the night. Ariza spots up wide open behind a Landry screen. Trevor Ariza, like Jared Jack, one of those guys that everybody everybody wants to have, doesn't seem to hold an address very long. 
does have a championship ring from a year with the Lakers. Yeah, it's another guy. We talked about Jared Jack. It's guys that whose services are always needed on a team. Marcus saw oh, what a play. Zach Randolph drops another dime. And this Grizzlies team offensively, Brevin, is very, very good. And the Hornets all year have hung their hat on defense, giving up the fourth fewest points per game at 93 and a half. And I gotta say, I don't think I think the last big that I saw really make great pass out of post was Kim Olajuwon, the guy who made pinpoint passes when he was double teamed. And right now, Zebo is great at it. That's good defense by Mike Conley against a much longer Trevor Ariza. Gasol driving against Landry, and Landry commits his third foul. And Landry spreads his hands as if to say, you know, what can I do? The Grizzlies offensively getting behind Sam Young. Yeah, he can watch that move by Sam Young. And then here, nice post position by Mark and Sam with a nice pass. And then those brothers from another mother, they know where each other is. <laughs> Six feeds for Randolph, his season high is seven. Another one. Uh, except this all can't convert it. And Mark pointed at Zach and said, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't tell Mom. Gasol has a dozen. Chris Paul dribbles it off his leg. Landry got bumped. Nearly banked it in. Guard tight move there by Carl Landry. Board for Landry in that win in New Orleans. And also Zach averaging four assists against the Hornets this year. Gasol body bumping and another foul on Landry. You know, I really, really like what the Grizzlies are doing. They're not backing down. They're not going on cruise control. They're not content or happy with the fact that they're in the playoffs. Checks his feet. Got by Conley. Pass bobbled around, but Willie Green with a show and go. And Gasol draws the offensive foul. And Willie Green says, I didn't hit him. And Steve Jabby says, I don't want to hear it. Leon Wood made the call, and Marcus Gasol did a good job of embellishing. I was about to say, partner, we... This, for us, we'll say that was a great charge taken by Mark Gasol. If you're sitting down the table somewhat and you are New Orleans Hornet, you are highly upset at that target's call on Willie Green. This is get a break on the foul call there. Randolph works against Okafor, steps back off the heel. Gasol tried to tap it, but Aaron Gray has it. A little different trying to tap it over Aaron Gray and tapping over the top of Carl Landry. Okafor, blocked by Gasol. Sam Young against Willie Green, a collision. Paul goes tumbling, Sam goes down. And Sam will go to the free throw line, and the first key to tonight's game, nobody gets hurt. <laughs> Please just get up, Sam. Sam tonight is done. This is great defense on this side by Mark. And then Sam tonight has been very physical going to the basket, putting his body on defenders. Set again. He had a season high 31 against Phoenix on Friday night. As the Hornets won 109-97. They shot a season best 56% in that ball game. Grizzlies holding them to 43%. Gasol down the lane trying to Statue of Liberty. Oh no. And Mark Gasol goes down along with Aaron Gray. And Mark pops right back up. Man, that was that is close, man. And that's one of those things that hopefully plays through it today. Get some treatment. We'll have a look here. It just falls awkwardly. I think oh. there was a little knee to knee, maybe. It's like his right ankle. Lucky Graff was right ankle is a better yeah. look here. Yeah. Uh -huh. I wonder if that right ankle tends to buckle up under him as he's coming. You see him grab a little bit at. They get to create all of that together as a team. So this will be exciting to watch. Marcus Shaw was being held by Okafor, and amazingly, Chris Paul remains scoreless. The foul on Okafor, he is third. He was able to slip through for that baby. A reason 21 Friday against the Suns, only nine tonight. Mayo catching two for three, it's through. OJ Mayo has both of the Grizzlies' three point makes. Shooting adductor muscle the last time these teams met in this building it was March 4th and the Hornets won 98-91 as Chris Paul went off for 23 points and 14 assists. He has zero points but 10 assists. Mayo slips through the double team, fades, and hits with two seconds remaining. A score move there. That is a score move. 
Ariza from beyond midcourt, and Darrell Arthurs is not in our house. The Grizzlies post 30 points in the third quarter while limiting the Hornets to 19. There, I wanted to make the playoffs to, to, to appreciate our fans too, and it was a lot of emotions in that game. Yeah, I was just pretty much just praying. You know, just thanking God that, you know, he's about to get us into these playoffs. We just got a sign of relief, you know, like, so, you know, it felt good, you know. Um, now it's just where it begins. The sky's the limit for us as long as we come in and just play hard and play together. Everybody was talking about the playoffs, and now we're here. And now we ain't here just to be here. We're here to try to win. The season 10 years in the making will extend into the postseason. Here come the playoffs to Memphis. Shot clock to game clock, Mayo for three. And the home portion of the 2010-2011 season will come to a most satisfying conclusion Jared Jack makes. And that makes the final score 111 to 89. The Grizzlies blow out the New Orleans Hornets. And the season series is split down the middle. 2-2, the Grizzlies shoot 60% from the floor. They hold the Hornets to 41%. The Hornets won.